It was quite the matchup yesterday in Orlando at the Cheez-It Bowl. Two teams with rich traditions in deep roots in college football. The 13th ranked Florida State looking to cap off their season with 10 wins for the first time in six years. And the Sooners were dressed in white with crimson accents, while the Seminoles suited up in their classic garnet jerseys with their gold pants. Now Oklahoma won the coin toss and elected to receive in the second half, so Florida State will start with the ball. And they strike first with three as Oklahoma defense able to keep them from seven. In the following drive, Dylan Gabriel, he's going to drop back. He's looking, looking, and Jaleel Farouk cuts across, making the grab, and the Sooners are going to jump ahead by four. 7 to 3. And the rest of the first quarter in a scoring drought, Oklahoma lined up in front of the end zone to start the second. Gabriel with the quarterback keeper, he darts alongside the outside and finds the right corner of the end zone, now a 14 to 3 game. The Knolls needing to make something happen. Jordan Travis fakes the handoff. He's on the move. He finds Ontario Wilson in the back of the end zone for their first touchdown of the night. And then following that tight end Wyatt Rector, he'll get the ball. He finds Brian Courtney for the two point conversion to make it now a 14 to 11 game. And Oklahoma will lead 17 to 11 going into the half and to start the second. But not for long as Treshawn Ward runs it in and Florida State now leads by just one point. Beginning of the fourth quarter, Sooners on the offense. Gavin Sawchuck runs it in for a touchdown and a successful two point conversion will put the Sooners up. Jordan with the handoff to Ward. He's showing off his speed tonight with this 38 yard touchdown run, and that's going to tie it back up now at 25 apiece. And then another one for the Knowles. This time it's Markinston Douglas, and now FSU is up by seven. Gabriel with the handoff to Javante Barnes. He runs alongside the outside and sneaks into the end zone, now 32 points each. Florida State's going to finish how they started with a kick to put them up 35 to 32. And with not enough time left on the clock for the Sooners, the Seminoles will be crowned the 2022 Cheez-It Bowl champs. FSU quarterback Jordan Travis will be named as this year's Cheez-It Bowl MVP. Last night, he was 27 of 38, 418 passing yards and two touchdowns. Mike Norvell says what made this season so successful was the people supporting this program. Disappointed in some of the setbacks that we faced you know, earlier in the season, uh, but these guys never stop working, they never stop believing. Uh, you know, this is a special place. I mean, this is a remarkable program to be a part of, and you know, it's it's, it's not just you know you know things that have been in the history of the past. I mean, it's the people, and when you get them around, the, the past players that have come around, and they you, you see their support, you see their excitement, you see their joy. Uh, we represent them. We represented, I mean, that, that fan base that was out there, that was special tonight. I mean, you, you look, we played, we played in a couple of different places. Going into the New Orleans to kick off the season in, in, in a classic game, and the old family showed up. But tonight in the bowl game, once again, the old family showed up. I mean, this is a this is a remarkable program to be a part of. The Seminoles finished their season as champions, bowl champions, with a 10 and three record.